Market recycles possession for the visitors. James McCarthy back to Darren Murphy. Dispossessed by Mikey Place, who breaks clear on the left. Wilson Roweru is inside. Wilson Roweru has four goals to his credit already. This season, Place has, takes a tumble in the area. He's taken down in the area there. It seems by James McCarthy, it will be a penalty to Galway United. Keating steps up, scored two penalties against Cove Ramblers at St. Coleman's Park earlier in the season. He scored six already this season for Galway United. Can he make it seven? Sean Barron bounces around between the sticks. Keating steps up, goes low, goes hard, rattles the back of the net. Goal number seven of 2021 for Rory Keating in a Galway United shirt. John Caulfield's men lead by one goal to nil, Vinny. Yeah, look, a great start there. Um, penalty wasn't the most convincing. Keeper got a hand to it, but it looked, they all counted. You know, he's got seven goals now already, which is a great start. And he's, you know, he's been creating quite a lot too. I think he's two or three assists, so. But it looks as if Turner might be the man to hit this. Has scored one goal this season. Ian Turner, right-footed effort, well gathered by goalkeeper Conor Kearns. Um, it makes it much easier, and he's very clever, like there from the throw-in. He's unmarked because of his movement. Keating. Dashes clear on the left, O'Reardon goes out to put him under a bit of pressure, Keating does well to dig out a shot. Nice save from Sean Barron, the Cove Ramblers goalkeeper. Ian Turner takes it down. Again, David hooks it forward, looking for Hegarty to go and chase. Jake Hegarty has scored three goals this season for Cove. Connor Kearns, though, smashes it back into the Cove half. Rory Keating control the ball and then again went for the ambitious effort. But that's what happens when you have that bit of confidence, you're willing to try things. Didn't work out on that occasion. Keating, the goal scorer, Hurley, leaves it for Connor McCormack. McCormack dinks it towards the back post. Killian Bruder climbs high, makes a firm header connection. His header clips the woodwork, Vinny. Yeah, if it, you know, if it was set a bit further wide towards the, the far post, I think it's probably going in. But it was just too close to where he actually headed it. It was too central. to Nathan Coleman, Mikey Place though does well to win possession back for Galway United, David Hurley the former Cove man drives forward for the home team to Wilson Waweru, Waweru has Keating in the area, Waweru smashes the ball into the back of the Cove net, the fifth goal of the season for the inform Wilson Waweru, what an effort it was. He scored a peach of a goal in the UCD Bowl last weekend, Vinny. He's added another to the collection this evening. Yeah, it's, look, it's great play. He's taken it. He's, he, he's bought his time. He's got that yard in. What a finish. Like, there's no doubt that that's not a ball across the box. That's a shot. You know, he's, it's, it's, it's absolutely perfect. Three goals himself this season, Kieran Griffin. And Cormac's free kick to Alex Murphy. Alex Murphy. Nice bit of skill from the youngster. His cross goes into the area. Wilson Rowero leaves it for Mikey Place. Mikey Place smashes it. Just doesn't hit the target. Clever work from Wilson Rowero to leave the ball run through for Mikey Place. Just couldn't find the finish, but plenty to admire in Rowero's thought there, Vinny. Yeah. McCormack's corner kick goes into the area, headed on at the front post by Morris Nugent. Took a deflection, goes out for a corner kick at the far side, and David Hurley goes across to take Vinny. Yeah, it's another great corner. You know, it's obviously a team, Galway, just want to push um, the other team and particularly their goalkeeper under pressure and everything gets kind of put in on top. Players Galway are bringing, off, are bringing on are, are as good as what you'd see in 90% in of the starting lineups you know, around the country. <laughs> Foul there by Lee David on Conor McCormack. You mentioned the bench, David. Yellow carded by referee Rob Dowling. For Galway United supporters hugely encouraged by the recent form David Hurley with a corner oh. kick into the area Barron does well to get a, a fist on to that and however there will be a free kick for the visitors Darren Murphy delivers it right footed into the area Connor Kearns comes and makes a save Ian Turner's subsequent effort hacked away and Cooper denied on that occasion by Connor Kearns Deep into stoppage time here at Eamon DC Park. Galway United set to secure a fifth win on the Spain. Referee Rob Dowling blasts the full time whistle. An encouraging evening for Galway United, Vinny, who controlled the game from start to finish. Yeah, they did. Look, you know, with a, a few hairy moments there.